Well, the music industry is cutthroat, and with the pandemic hitting, it's even more so for local musicians who are trying to make a name for themselves. New this morning, Erin Fields talked with the Bismarck artist to see how she's been making it through this pandemic. Good morning, Erin. Good morning, Josh and Alicia. Josh, I don't know if you know Alicia studied music, but... I do. It's my major. Yeah, so Alicia, wouldn't you say music is a pretty cutthroat oh, business? Oh, is it ever? You got a lot of fish in the sea. Yeah, and then with this coronavirus, mm -hmm. I can't even imagine. No. But um, I did talk to Natalie Esslinger, who's been singing, playing the guitar and piano for as long as she can remember. She's been working nonstop on trying to get her name out there, but the pandemic has hit her hard. When I was younger, um, I sang outside to my kittens. That's where it really started. <laughs> my parents would make fun of me because I would sing in hoses. In 2017, Natalie Esslinger made the move to Montana to jumpstart her career. She did open mic nights and built up a strong fan base. Right away, it was a little harder, um, but I'm, I'm definitely someone who's a social butterfly and I like networking. So it kind of came a little maybe easier to me because I kept meeting more and more people and getting more and more shows. She moved back to North Dakota to keep pursuing her passion, booking shows, gaining more fans, and just when it seemed like she was finally making it, COVID-19 hit. I've only played one live, no, I've played two live gigs. But other than that, all of our band gigs got canceled. I had to cancel everything else. And that's a big income loss, you know, so it's, it's been a huge change, I think, for every musician in town. Unlike some local musicians, Esslinger says she isn't completely dependent on her music career for income, but she tells me it's still not the same. When you work so hard to get where you were so you could get out of a certain part of what you didn't want to be in, and then you have to switch back to it, it's kind of it's kind of interesting. I gave one of my, um, told one of my fellow employees the other day, I was like, you go from a rock star to cooking burgers in, in just a couple months, <laughs> so. Solid Rock Music, Esslinger's favorite music store in the area, has recognized these local artists' struggles. And they're showing support, even while they have problems of their own. But I've just been trying to help them out as much as I can uh, through all of this, you know, help them get some gear they need, maybe at a better price, you know, just until they kind of get back up on their feet. As businesses and bars are slowly opening, Esslinger says she's happy to see the music scene open back up a little. It's been very emotional to see live bands again, um, and it definitely makes you not regret it, not take it for granted, and it's an awesome thing. So I hope a lot of other people appreciate live music again, too. For now, all she can do is scream from the top of her lungs and ask, I really want to go sing along with her right now, but Esslinger says social media has been her saving grace and tries to post as much as she can for her fans to stay in contact. But Josh and Alicia, as you heard, her voice is pretty amazing. You're gonna have to go check out all her videos on Facebook. Absolutely. But you know, Luke, our director in the morning, is also in a band, and he kind of knows firsthand how hard it's been for all of them. So I can't even imagine right yeah. now. Yeah, I mean, that's, that's a big hit for them. and. Yeah. I, I have to say, it. I, I, it's interesting that you didn't say you want to go listen to her. You said, I want to go sing with her. I know, and I don't have a great <laughs> voice, but I'm going to, I told I'd her. I'd like to go listen to her. Yes, I'll, yes, let's all go listen to her. <laughs> okay. I won't sing and with her. And as we know from Luke, uh, bars are slowly backing, yeah. uh, slowly getting back open, and, and, and musicians are starting to play again, so Positivity yes. right there, Positivity. yes. Exactly. We need the music. Exactly. And Amber, I think you have some music for our ears uh, in terms yeah. of uh, weather. We've got some it's good looking temperatures here. It'll be nice to hear some live music again. I haven't heard any live music in a while. Here's